Hi everyone, this is a video about this Sony Walkman, which is in good condition. I explain later uh, what happened to it before I got my hands on it. The model number is WM10. This is one of those that is very sought after and it's in relative good condition with minimal damage because if you remember this one age is about uh, 35 years old maybe more and is in perfect working order at the moment i explained to you what i have done to it apart from the belt which is a normal uh, fault with these and because of the age the belt was uh, turned into mush and it's because the mechanism is very small it's very hard to clean so uh, two hours of cleaning and then it had a dent here if you can see there and this dent had caused a severe problem which uh, caused this to turn into mono sound so and uh, problem solving and problem finding was a little bit of uh, hassle but finally I have managed to do that and these are one of the smallest ever uh, Sony Walkmans which is the same size uh, of course this is this is a cheating uh, from uh, Sony because in order to listen to this you have to extend this like so and then you put your tape in there so it's not exactly the smallest one ever because this part sticks out and the tape is inside now and this one another problem that it had was that the door was broken and these doors these battery covers are really really difficult to open so you have to push this this one was broken and I have fixed it and if you look at this edge this a little bit of notch that is coming out with pressing this this one is going in and most of the time this is the color gray but mine as you see is white because I have totally uh, remade this in order for the battery cover to stay shut so in order to do that you have to uh, because this is a, a stock on plastic on metal so you have to remove this and then the mechanism are inside and then you can do that so i have managed to repair this in very successful manner but i'm not using this uh, it's, ju it's just for the collection and so on so now the battery cover is open let me just install a battery in there it takes a single double a battery and i put it in there and remember to use this because getting the battery out of here is really difficult later on without this ribbon here so and then you put this there let me just do it gently here and then push this back and then push this down and push this forward to stay put in there now is on and these 
they have some problems as well as the as it ages uh, this noise of the motor is getting louder and louder and louder and something else that happened to this one is uh, because of the uh, uh, fall that it had suffered uh, the um, the mechanism which uh, causing it uh, to not to work when uh, headphone jack is out is just uh, not working anymore so as I press the play button you can hear the noise is rather loud remember I have fully refurbished this oiled it and everything is in perfect working order at the moment but it's loud anyhow uh, I have some video of, uh, some uh, images of this from inside to show you that uh, what had um, what it looks looks like from inside as well as uh, um, how I repaired the mono uh, uh, headphone out I just get my other phone and come back so here are some images from the board inside this is one side of it and then let me just see this is the inside and the belt goes like so if you can see that and then problem that caused the mono uh, headphone out it was just right there and I have some other images that I can just show you uh, let me just find it you see this ribbon let me open, uh, maximize it you see this ribbon a part of this ribbon here was cracked or broken so I had to use the, a very very tiny wire to connect it from here down to here somewhere let me just see if I can find a better image of that a larger image oh here this is a larger image if I maximize it you can see here that the ribbon is broken from there let me see if I can make it even bigger is here so I had to after many hours of looking at this on the uh, you know magnifying glass uh, or something that is you know can look through the ribbon I realized that this one is broken so I have fixed it but unfortunately the function that it works without the uh, headphone I couldn't fix that uh, if anyone knows about this please leave a comment down below these are just the, the, just general pictures that I gathered from inside just to show you what is going on inside so now only thing that is left is to just put a tape in there and have a go at playing a song so let's uh, rewind it yes and as you see the motor is a strong and loud and it's doing its job now and the stop and all of them when you press a stop still you can hear the motor is running for a couple of seconds as you see now listen yeah and then the headphone I put 
a headphone jack in there adjust the volume to reasonable volume and then play something And because it's rather old, it just has uh, the tape selector and Dolby. This is Dolby. And this is tape selector. I have the screw here as well from the source that I purchased this uh, he gave me the broken you know belt clip but I couldn't fix it because a big chunk of it was broken yes Rewind it a little bit. I go and get the belt clip So let's let me just play the song This is the belt clip that big chunk of it is missing From here from the place that the screw Supposed to go there It's just missing all the way around so I couldn't fix this although that I think I'm good at fixing but this one requires a lot of same color plastic and this is the original screw with a spring attached so this is the price of this it goes from 120 pounds minimum not working in really bad condition and goes up to 500 pounds if it's in box not used but if you find something like this working condition without major scratches with uh, uh, Sony it's a Sony sign here and no damage anywhere else in my case only here of course this was dented really badly I straightened the dent somehow with a, a small piece of wood very gently obviously so that's how I could fix this anyhow I hope you like this video and until my next video take care of yourself and each other and as always have a great time by all means i'm recommending this if you got your hands on one of these at reasonable price maybe under 120 pounds by all means it's worth every penny if you can fix it yourself anyway until my next video, see you later guys.